Cats, this is Miss Henderhan. I'm here to talk to you about some books that I would recommend and I want you to know I changed out of my pajamas and put on makeup just for you. All right, I couldn't decide which ones I wanted to tell you about, so I have a few and then I'm gonna book talk one. So if you need a break from stress um, and you wanna laugh, I would recommend anything by David Sedaris. My personal favorite is Me Talk Pretty One Day. All right, if you would like to escape into some fantasy, I recommend The Ocean at the End of the Lane by Neil Gaiman. And finally, some realistic fiction uh, called Tell the Wolves I'm Home. Uh, it's a great read, all right? But the one I wanna tell you about today is called The Age of Miracles by Karen Thompson Walker, and it's one of my favorites. All right, this book tells the story of Julia, a teenager in California, and right before her birthday, something called The Slowing Occurs, in which the rotation of the earth begins to slow. And by the time experts figure out what's happening, a day has stretched to 25 hours and just gets longer every day. Um, you will definitely see some parallels to uh, what's happening in the world today um, in terms of how people react. So some people adjust and just roll with it. Uh, some people think it's a government hoax. Some people go to extremes and join religious cults. Um, after weeks of chaos, the American government decides to follow clock time which means that you follow the time on the clock, even though 8 a.m. might look like midnight um, and bedtime could be in the middle of the day and there's no consistency, it's always changing. Uh, there's also a segment of the population that disagrees with clock time and they attempt to keep daylight hours, even though that might mean staying up for 24 hours straight and I don't know about you, but the last time I did that, no one was happy. Um, um, while that's all very exciting, I think what actually makes the story so interesting and real is that in the midst of this crisis, Julia is just trying to live her life and navigate the world of being a teenager, dealing with normal insecurities, trying to fit in, having her first boyfriend. Um, and I think that uh, that's what a lot of people are going through right now, is just trying to live their lives in the, in the midst of things being in up, upheaval. So it's a great read, Age of Miracles. So I hope that you are enjoying sleeping in you are practicing good safe distancing or uh, social distancing.